Hello everyone, I'm Seth with Exotic Motorsports and this is our 2005 Porsche 911 Carrera S with 26,321 miles. This car is beautiful, it's been kept in very, very good shape. Front end does not have very many rock chips, almost zero. The ones that it does have are very difficult to see. This have a scratch right there, small rock chip. Does not have very many imperfections at all. The front end looks amazing. Uh, moving over to the driver's side front fender. No defects there. Driver's side front wheel. Has kind of a matte silver finish to it. They look amazing. They look so nice. Driver's side mirror. No issues there. No marks, no blemishes. Driver's side door. <coughs> Excuse me. Door looks awesome. It looks like we do have potentially the world's smallest dent. It's hard to tell. It looks like there may be a defect. I'm probably just seeing things. I don't think there's a dent there. I apologize for that. My eyes are playing tricks on me. The silver looks so nice, especially in the sun so much depth and metallic flake to it it really has such a nice personality no issues with the driver's side rear quarter panel driver's side rear wheel looks great but does have one small blemish there otherwise the wheel looks perfect moving on to the back of the bumper we do have a little bit of scuffing here in the bottom section very easy to miss that Apologize for the shadows, it is later in the day. The back end of the car looks really good. The only defects to note are these right here by the rear driver's side wheel. Otherwise, the rest of the back end looks awesome. And it does have the active aero option where this engine cover actually opens up. Not the entire engine cover, but this section right here will open up. You can do that with a switch in the interior. I do have photos of that documented to show that it does operate correctly. Passenger side, looking at the rear quarter panel. We do have two scratches there. But otherwise it looks great. Rear passenger wheel. No defects at all, looks perfect. Passenger door, no issues there. Passenger mirror, not even a single rock chip. Oh, but it does have a scuff on the outside, just about missed that. Very small scuff on the outside there. Front passenger fender, looks really good. Front passenger wheel, also excellent condition with no defects. I'll go ahead and walk around the car from a one foot distance to give you a better big picture idea of the overall condition of the car. Here at Exotic Motorsports, we do these comprehensive walk around videos for our out of state buyers to give them the confidence and peace of mind they need to purchase a vehicle from us sight unseen if they choose to do so. Walking around the car from a one foot distance is a lot more indicative of what you might notice on a day to day basis if you were to own the car yourself and does help separate the smaller, less obvious flaws from the bigger, more noticeable ones, giving you a better, well-rounded idea of the overall condition of the vehicle. So hopefully by me walking around the car, kind of have a better idea of how good it's been kept and how well it's been taken care of. Uh, personally, I think this is a beautiful car. Paint looks great. It looks like it's been taken very, very good care of. This car being 16 years old, you certainly wouldn't know it just by looking at it. Here on the interior, we do have black leather. Timeless classic interior option. So we do have heated power adjustable seats with memory profiles. We do have one touch up and down windows for the driver and passenger side. We do have power adjustable side mirrors, twilight sensing headlights. 
and this is a six speed manual which was definitely the most fun variant until the PDK came out. Then it's a pretty close toss up, it kind of just depends on what you want, but this definitely beats the Tiptronic that Porsche started out with, the five speed automatic. Six speed manual is way better. So we have navigation, believe it or not, actually a decent navigation setup for 2005. Good job, Porsche. Two stage heated seats for the driver and passenger. We've got automatic climate control which is impressive for its time you can actually set it on auto and then it will dictate the fan speed and all the other options to obtain the temperature you desire there's the uh, active air button i was talking about i'll go ahead and activate that extend the rear spoiler we also have electronic suspension dampening here uh, again just an absolute game changer for 2005 Rearview mirror looks great. We've got our power sunroof controls there. And then we do actually have universal garage door remotes as well, which is pretty impressive. Leather dash <coughs> looks phenomenal. No UV damage or sun damage. All looks very nice. Uh, passenger seat here looks really, really good. No blemishes. I'm gonna hop out of the car in just a minute. I will show you the rear seats as well. Uh, so far, the only buttons I've seen that have any kind of wear is the temperature control on the HVAC unit right here. So that, um, I know it's really bright, might be kind of hard to see, but the, uh, I guess the fan speed is a little bit worn out as well. So those two buttons, um, the writing on them is a little bit worn off, but the window switches, mirror adjustment, uh, memory switches, everything on the stocks over here is all in fantastic shape. And there you can see the mileage. We're sitting at 26,339. So I will go ahead and hop out real quick and show you those back seats. I'll go ahead and pop the back engine compartment as well. Here we've got the two back passenger seats. Try and get out of that sun flare. Uh, but the two seats look awesome. I do apologize for that sun flare, that was very aggressive. If you want a better look, um, check out our photos on the sales listing on our website. Pretty large amount of very comprehensive detailed photos to show you every inch of the car. If you have any questions about the condition of anything from this video, engine sounds great. Idle is very smooth. Uh, Idle is really quiet. It honestly almost doesn't even sound like a Porsche. Porsches are typically really loud and rattly, and this one sounds surprisingly smooth. Sounds really good. Uh, runs and drives great. Goes through all the gears. Really smooth. This car is so much fun to drive. Porsche is the living proof that you don't need four digit horsepower to have fun with the car. Um, the way this handles, the way it goes through the gears, I mean, it's incredibly, incredibly fun. Uh, suspension is something that Porsche has always really hit the nail on the head with. And this car is an absolute testament to that. This thing is so much fun to drive. It's hard to beat the enjoyment of a Porsche. So that is our 2005 Porsche 911 Carrera S. If you have any further questions, please feel free to check out the sales listing on our website at exoticmotorsportsok.com. Thank you for watching.